In this video, I'm going to look at how you can create both vertical and horizontal scale widgets. We looked at this computer program in the previous video, and you may wish to watch that first. So if you're on the YouTube channel and you look in the description, you'll see the link to the previous video in the playlist. The runtime for the computer program is coming into view now. And if you consider these two lines, the first line that I'm referencing is responsible for creating the scale and the second line is responsible for placing it within the window. And you can see we get this vertical scale. This computer program shows a slight amendment from the one we've just been looking at and the amendment can be seen here. I've added orient is assigned horizontal. And if we have a look at the runtime for this computer program what we will see is this and you can look to the scale and you can see it is now along the horizontal lines associated with the orientation of the window. I have amended the computer program again and the amendment is shown here and if I allow the program to run what you will get is this and if you look you can see that the scale is now in the vertical direction. For this horizontal scale, you can see the slider is here, and I can move that, and you can see the value above is changing, and I can move it from the 0 all the way up to the 100, and I can leave it at any position within the scale. With the vertical scale, I can grab hold of the slider, and I can move it down to 100, I can move it up to 0, and I can leave it at any position on the scale. Please consider subscribing to the channel and click the bell to ensure you get an update every time I upload a video. Maybe you would like to consider supporting the development of these free videos via Patreon. In addition, why not follow me on Twitter and also check out the supporting website.